at the time of Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam, there was a man and he was sitting in the court of Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam. Another man came in. Another man came in. And this man was none other than the angel of death in human form. So the angel of death came into the court of Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam. And he started staring and continuously gazing at this young man sitting next to Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam. Now obviously if somebody is gazing at you and continuously staring at you, you're going to be scared. You're going to think, what the hell is this guy's problem? And this is what he was thinking. He was absolutely frightened to death, this guy. So, after a little while, the angel of death left. And this young man asked Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam, that, who was that guy? You know, he was looking at me you know, like he's never seen another human in his life. He's staring at me. Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam informed him that that was the angel of death. This person becomes more frightened for his life. He says, oh Suleiman, he was the way he was looking at me, he is definitely thinking about taking my soul. So oh Suleiman, you do summer. Suleiman alayhi salatu was says to him, well, what do you want me to do? You know, if your times come, your times come, what can I do about it? So he says to him, oh Suleiman, you have power over the winds. Order these winds to take me to India. Now look where Suleiman is. And look where India is. Look how far it is. You know, Jerusalem is sitting there. And he's ordering him, take me to India. So Suleiman he did a favor upon him. He ordered the winds and the winds carry this man to India. As soon as he lands in India, what does he find? The angel of death is there in front of him. And he takes out his sword. At a later time when the angel of death came to Suleiman alayhi salatu was salam, Suleiman asked him that, you know, why were you continuously gazing at this man? Why were you standing him down? So the angel of death said that, you know, Allah ordered me to take his soul. And when I came to your court, I was wondering that Allah ordered me to take his soul in India and he's sitting here next to you. How is he going to get to India? How is he going to get to India? Why is he sitting with you? But this man voluntarily made his way to India and I was there waiting to take out his son. Allah. Allah knows where you will die, my friend. Only Allah knows. Say to them, O Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, that this death that you flee from will grab you. This death that you run away from, this death that you flee from, you try to escape from, فَإِنَّهُ مُلَاقِيكُمْ It will grab you. And then you will return to Allah, the knower of the unseen and the seen. And he will then inform you what you got up to in the dunya.